Tekoa is a small town, but there's a lot of talent here, a lot of talent. My name is Deborah Hartley, and in 1990, I started the Art Guild. I moved to Tekoa in 1976. Uh, I just graduated from college and I was looking for work and took the position of high school art teacher at Stevens County High. Then I just, I found a building downtown that I thought was really interesting. I rented it for two years and just wanted to start an art gallery and offer art lessons. It wasn't very successful <laughs> back in the day. Since the art gallery and the lessons weren't going great, I put in a picture framing shop, and that was wonderful. That really was a good business. And then I tried again with the art gallery and the art lessons, and it took off. And then we decided to celebrate with our Meet the Artists in February. It was kind of a quiet month after the holidays and everything. We've been doing it for a number of years, and it's been really, really successful. And we just invite the whole town to come to our party. We have food and drink and music and good art and good conversation. And, and it's, it's been good. It's, it kind of brings us together. I think artists, we work kind of by ourselves. It's kind of a solitary endeavor. You know, we get in our studios and we make our art. We never talk to anybody. Then we put it out there sometimes when there's art shows. And we're interesting people. You know, we're creative. <laughs> but we just thought it'd be great to get together, you know, invite the town to talk to us. You know, we're not a lot of times art weirdos, you know, <laughs> these crazy creative people. But we're good, you know, and we're fun and open. And and we just thought it's time you guys got to really get to know who we truly are. Over the years, I have noticed more and more participation. So people are becoming aware that we're, we're an entity. We are here. We have something to offer. Art has been forever we we all need it and I think it's becoming more and more acceptable here and more appreciated there is a future for art in Tekoa my goal now is to really inspire the younger students to become involved in the guild or just become appreciators of art just let it be a part of their lives from early on I always knew I was going to be involved with art and and even early on I knew I was going to be an art teacher I actually should be retired, but um, that just isn't a word I, I can embrace right now. <laughs> I don't think I could live if I didn't have this art. It's, it's important. I need it.